Here's how to fix unable to launch game. Please try reinstalling the game error for GTA 5. Let's go. Now, if you have the game on Steam or Epic Games, it's going to be very similar. Even if you have it on the Xbox Game Pass, it's going to be similar. So try to follow along. What we need to do is locate the installation folder of GTA 5 first. So if you're on Steam, you could right click on your game and then press browse logo files. And if you have the game on Epic Games, find your game in here. I don't have GTA installed through Epic Games, but if you have it installed, let's say this was GTA 5, you're going to press on these three dots. You're going to press on manage. You're going to press right here where it says open install location and that is going to open the installation folder of GTA 5. Now, once you're in the installation folder, I want you to find a file called X input. Usually this file will be towards the end. As you can see, my X input file is right here. If you don't find it, you could just search for it right here. X input, just go ahead and type it in there. Once you see X input, you want to select it and then you want to go ahead and delete it. And then once you delete X input, you also want to delete the ARGS file. So go ahead and search for that file in here and you'll find this TXT file in here. Go ahead and delete it as well. And then once you deleted that file too, you want to go back to the launcher wherever you're playing GTA. It could be Epic Games or it could be Steam or even the Xbox launcher if you have the Xbox Game Pass. And what you want to do is right click on your game, press on properties and then find launch options. If you're on Steam, you would do it over here, right? And then on the launch options, you want to type the following, go ahead and type the minus sign and then put no battle I like that. No battle I then press a space, type the minus sign again and then put no BE with the B being caps. And then you can put that also on your Epic Games launcher if you have the game through here. And if you're in Rockstar launcher, just go ahead and head over to the options and disable Battle Eye from there. And then once you type that in here, guys, just go ahead and try launching your game. And there you guys have it. That should have fixed your issue for GTA 5. And if this video helped you, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time.